Uh, when I was like 19, I was modelling mm. in South Korea. <laughs> yeah, fashion capital of the world. <laughs> Some might say it's Tokyo or Paris <laughs> or Milan, but I went to Seoul because basically my boobs were too big for Japan. <laughs> That's what they said to me. Like I would sink the place if I landed with my big knockers. <laughs> yeah. So I got shipped off to South Korea to Seoul and it was incredible, incredible experience. I was 90 and I made a brilliant friend, despite the fact that on that trip, the Korean makeup artist, we were on this minibus because we were on a job like overnight and we were all traveling around doing all these photo shoots and the, uh, the makeup artist, came at me to do my eyebrows and she came out with an old fashioned like prison style flip out razor Ooh. to start to go at my eyebrows and I was watching in a little mirror and then I was like no no enough now no more no more because they were trying to really shave my eyebrows off. Mel does that to my Jack and Danny before this so... <laughs> And so I managed to fend her off and she left my eyebrows alone and then she went over to Claire oh. who was asleep oh. and I sort of I remember just watching, thinking, should I wake her up? <laughs> because she's going to have no eyebrows left. And then I remember just thinking, nah. <laughs> it's quite funny to see what happened. <laughs> so Claire was, like, fast asleep with her beautiful full eyebrows oh, and the makeup artist was like... Wah, 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 wah. Oh, but then they put loads of makeup on, so we didn't know what damage had okay. been done okay. until yeah. she washed off her makeup. And what was left? We're talking tufts. Oh. We're talking oh. two little there. Like sort of Hitler eyebrows. <laughs> well, not like the, yeah. Yes. No, Mini central like... mustachey horrid. I mean. Oh. Yeah, it was pretty brutal, and I didn't. I didn't really stop them, and I could have done. Did they grow back? Not they really. really did. No. That's the thing with eyebrows, gang. Nabil, are you all right there, lovey? I'm just traumatized thinking about that. <laughs> <laughs> no, How could worried. you do that? That's terrible. You shit in a bag and threw it at your yeah. friend's dad. <laughs> <laughs> So is it Sarah's eyebrowless buddy, Nabil's troubled train station manager, or Keith's pissed off but quite attractive restaurant manageress? <laughs> Let us reveal the conical headed, smurfy, lovely little friendly gnome. <gasps> Right, Just Claire, oh. hang on. Oh, they look all right. They're not real, that's why. Oh. <laughs> Did you, hang on, have you had um, implants? Tattoos. Have you? And did you have to do that because of what happened in Seoul? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I had no hair. I had a crew cut at the time, which was good until I had the two tufts. <laughs> Sarah found it hilarious. <laughs> And how did you feel towards your old pal, Coxie, Sarah? <laughs> well, we'd just made a pact, actually. We'd gone on location and become oh. best friends instantly. And Close. Said, you know, I've got your back forever. Yeah. We're just best friends, <laughs> pinky promise. <laughs> Twelve hours later, I had no eyebrows. 